Another object you can mail merge are emails. For example, I'm going to open up the newsletter. What I'd like to do is email this to each person I have in a contacts folder in my Outlook. So from the ribbon I'll click the Mailings tab and in the Start Mail Merge group I'll click the Start Mail Merge button and choose the option Step by Step Mail Merge Wizard. On my Mail Merge task pane I'll choose the option Email Messages and then click Next Starting Document at the bottom of the task pane. I'll then use the current document for my email and click Next Select Recipients at the bottom of the task pane. I'll then select from Outlook a particular contacts folder and I'll choose the contacts folder because you might have more than one. For example I might send this email to all the members of this particular contacts folder and I'll click OK. Eventually all the members of that contacts folder are listed and I'll go OK. I'll then click Next at the bottom of my Mail Merge task pane to write my email message. In between the date and dear, I'd like to insert an address block. And I'll click OK. At the end of the word dear, I'm going to click, press the space bar, and insert more items. And I'd just like to insert their first name. So I'll click Insert and Close. I'll then click Next at the bottom of my Mail Merge task pane. And I can preview my emails by hitting the recipient buttons. I'll then click Next to complete the merge. At this point you may want to make sure that you are not connected to the internet or to the network so that you can check the emails before they all go flying out your outbox. I'm going to click Electronic Mail. I'm going to send the email to their email address field because they might have more than one and I'm going to type the subject brochure for July 2013 and I'll click OK. What is happening and why um, the mouse is very busy is that a whole lot of emails are being constructed in the Outbox in Outlook and I might just go and check my Outbox in Outlook so I'll click on Outlook and in my Outbox I can see that it's generating quite a few items and eventually I'll end up with 93 emails which I could then hit send and send out. Each email is personal to each recipient. <coughs>